extravergine olive oil in the Lazio region is a very important commodity since the Roman times. The Romans were very good producers, exporters and consumers of extravergine olive oil and the production was so important the extravergine olive oil was in fact a commodity and the price was uh, quoted every week in the Roman Forum. We can identify in Lazio four main production areas. We have one production area in the north, in the province of Viterbo, then we move south and then we have Rome and Riedi, they are sharing what is called the Ro Sabina, and then moving south we have the provinces of Latina, so more towards the sea, and Frosinone moving along the mountains. The Viterbo area is mainly characterized by hills and volcanic lakes, so the altitude is not very high. Here grows a very special variety which is called Canino. They also one of the oil is named Canino. There are two protected designations of origin in the Tusha territory. We have Tusha and Canino. Protected designation of origin is a European certification system that implies that the whole production chain is checked from the single olives down to the packed product. The Sabina area is the widest production territory in the region and embraces two municipalities, Rome and Riedi. So this is very important because there are very many producers and the majority of the oil produced in the region comes from Sabina. Sabina was very known to the Romans. In actual fact, Pliny used to say that the best oil was coming from this area. Sabina is also one of the oldest protected designations of origin in, uh, in Europe. The Sabina territory is very diverse because we, we starting from Rome, we early, mainly have hills and then we're going all the way up to the Edi where we find mainly mountains. So the characteristics of the olive oil produced is very different. The main cultivar that characterizes the Sabina is the Carboncella. Moving southwest, we have the production area in Latina. This territory is characterized mainly by hills, but also is very strongly influenced by the sea breeze. Here we have the fourth PDO recognized for Lazio, which is Colline Contine, and the main olive cultivar is Itana. The last but not least production area is the area in Frosinone, so we are going mainly towards the mountains. Here we have excellent olive oil production, but this province doesn't have yet a protected designation of origin.